Hello, welcome back on my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to show how to use the standalone installer for QGIS. In previous videos, I've used the OS Geo4W installer. In this video, you will learn also how to add packages such as PC Raster to your installation. So in this case, you can use the PC Raster Tools plugin with the standalone installer. To install QGIS, go to QGIS.org. In the upper left, you can find the current version numbers. In this case, version 3.28 is the RC version. RC stands for Release Candidate. This version contains the newest features, but it can also introduce new bugs which need to be fixed over time. For operational use or courses, we use the LTR version. In this case, that's version 3.22. LTR stands for Long Term Release and is a version that is for a longer time maintained and bug fixed which gives more stability for operational use. Now click the Download Now button to go to the page with all the installers for the different platforms. The big green button is for the uh, release candidate 3.28 in this case, but here we will need the link to 3.22 LTR. If you click uh, the link, you can download the standalone installer for 3.22. After downloading, Run the file and go through the installation wizard by clicking Next. Accept the license agreement and keep the defaults and click Install to start the installation. Click Finish after the setup wizard is done, and then you can launch QGIS. However, we would like to add a package, so we're going to click right on the newly installed QGIS and choose Open File Location. That brings us to a list of shortcuts, and we need here the Setup shortcut. If we double click, it will not run. So we click right and we choose Run as Administrator. Now the OSGEO for w setup starts and we use the advanced install and we click next and keep all the defaults. Choose one of the available download sites. And here we can maximize the screen to see uh, what is installed with our uh, standalone installer, which is quite a lot. And that's also the difference with using the OSGEO for w installer. This download was around uh, one gigabyte if you have a low bandwidth or not much uh, disk space, it's uh, advised to use the OSGU for W installer method, which is explained in other videos. Here, search for PC Raster and uh, click the arrow to install. After installation, click Finish, and now the PC Raster package is added to your QGIS installation. You can run 3.22 now from the shortcut or from the start menu. And there's uh, QGIS 3.22. And if you go to the processing toolbox, you see Grass and Saga available there. And if you install the PC Raster Tools plugin, then it will also work because it can find uh, the PC Raster package in your installation. So if any plugin needs a package, you go back to the OSGO for W uh, setup and um, try to find the package that is missing. Mm -hmm. 